and how are you all hope you are doing very well so today listen we're going to cover a very important topic which is a middleware in Laravel I have a new project here nothing I didn't add anything just type in the command line Laravel new and type your project name and this will build your project then go to that folder and run PHP artisan surf and so it's running here so let's go ahead and and build the middleware so what is the middleware first of all so the middleware simply when the client request uh, HTTP request but in the browser the URL or through the API you want to make some pre-processing be before you get give him the response so for example we have the authentication middleware and other middleware as well so let's I believe the best thing here to build in practice so let's go ahead and create a new middleware so as usual PHP artisan uh, make everything you want to make you would make controller make model use make and then what we want to build is middleware okay what the name like let's call it check ish okay I type mistake here so we have check ish okay I believe I have another error here so artisan arts okay so that's and this has created the middleware for us if I go to the app uh, HTTP and middleware we have our middleware here so let's go ahead and create before I go and configure the middleware let's make a new route very quickly which will be in the ABI let's create a new route and get and let's define for example test will be and callback function will be let's return string for now but the same color okay so very cool stuff very cool let's visit this route and that's okay so we have the response successfully so before I uh, show this to the user give him the response I want to make some validation or pre-processing so this what come handy the middleware so we have created the middleware so let's for example check the request this one here okay request age is more than 200 if uh, it's um, smaller than 200 uh, 200 or equal just go back to the uh, previous page which would be like this okay so let's check this this one not going to work because we have built the middleware but we didn't tell them the route to use this middleware so we have to tell like this access to this method and what we're going to do is to give her the middle words is check we don't need to type a string here check age and class so what this mean class so in the laravel uh, six or more we, we we don't need to use a string and use the whole the qualify path so this we don't need to use this like blah 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 until the class name so this very handy way and very easy to access to the class okay so let's go ahead now and make refresh and see what happened okay so let's now go to the home page and let's make go to visit the test and let's make the age equal to 99 so as we can see we put 99 and this condition in the check age is smaller so he bring us back to the home page if we go again to that route and put the age 201 it will show the okay message here it's very cool stuff very cool stuff okay so how about if we have 100 route and we need to uh, 
put all the middleware i don't need to need to use this again and again and again so let's define a group middleware so we call it a route and let's call it middleware and let's define what the middleware so as we can see we can define array or a string we have only one middleware so we just uh, need to use just only one okay so what is the middleware check age class and this as we can see here okay a group and this need callback function okay so cool now so let's grab this now and delete this we don't need use this cool stuff cool stuff so this now will um, any function or any route inside this will uh, the check age middleware will run first first so let's go ahead yeah so let's give us the same result if i need to for example copy and paste this two i go to this two here oh sorry this two not three all right brilliant so this is the second way to define the middleware that the third one is to create a new controller and to use it in the construct in that controller so let's go ahead and create a new controller sorry the mouse okay so let's go ahead now and create a new controller php artisan make controller controller and let's call it home controller and okay let's create the controller for us okay let's command this and we are in the view here so we don't need so we need to retain the controller which is uh, home we just created home controller and the class and the action will be executed as index cool stuff cool stuff okay so let's go to this controller and define the function called index and let's go ahead and retain a view which is what the view will be welcome i believe yep so let's go ahead now and check if yep it should give us the same okay welcome it not exist yes so it exists because i make spell welcome okay so let's go ahead yep okay correctly so now let's go ahead now and use middleware and the construct here first of all we have to go to the kernel which is here and go to the route middleware and define the new middleware like this and i give it name check age and the new middleware will be what the new middleware controller middleware and check age yep so this bad boy here okay and we should give it the class like this okay and let's go back now to the check age we have it so let's use it now in the construct here so simply we define public function construct and what we're going to use this middleware okay sorry i should click okay middleware and what is the middleware is check age okay let's test this bad boy and this method is exists in the controller has pl plenty of method okay you don't need this has been done from laravel so then you don't need to worry about it so let's go ahead back here okay so let's define age should age yep test okay so we don't have this route so just okay so let's make okay so successfully it, it redirects us to the home which is correct if we need for example i go to the check age here and if less just go ahead and show us this page which not exist not exist so let's define like this and yep so it redirects us to here so this this 
uh, show you three methods to use the middleware it's very important to learn this is the basic stuff and hope you like this video please if you like it share and subscribe and yes usually every week i put upload two to three video so uh, don't forget to make the notification button on and you will get notification about any new video new feature from laravel and php thank you guys for your watching and see you in the next video bye